We are here at Dalton, Georgia at the Carpet City Poultry Show. We just bought two pairs of brassy backs and now I'm buying uh, splashes with my own money. So, yeah, let's do it. We just got brassy backs, uh, brassy backs, silver duckling, and splashes. This is the brassy backs. You gotta go right now. This is silver duckling, huh? Yeah. Those are splashes. So today I'm here with Mr. Beeson and he's going to be telling me about the breed and what to look for. So what do you look for in silver ducklings? Okay, we'll start with this hen first. Some of the main things you want a good smooth with the feathers, what they call stippling. You want that all the way through. The shafts. It, it's not good. You can set white shaft in her. Mm -hmm. But she's not a bad bird. She's got good tail. She's got good dark quills. But the, the shafting, this is a good breeder pair, but the shafting in a show bird is, is not what you want. She's got a good head on her, good red eye. Mm -hmm. Ear loads are good. Her breath, you want that salmon color, but you want to kind of try to avoid this shafting in here. You want it that good salmon all the way down to it start shading to a little gray right in there. That's okay. But that right there on the sides, it's something you have to watch whenever you're going through to pick out your show bird. And what do you look for in on your male birds, female line, I always look for a short, cobby body. When you put him in your hand, you can feel the key, his kill bone. You want to be able to have your your fingers. He's a little bit long in his kill. He could be a little shorter, cobbier body, but he's got good tail, good width in his feather. Good clean shafts, they're not white. It's got a little bit right there, but on your female line, that's no big deal. You want it. He's got a clean breast, but when I breed females, if they have a little white in their breast, it don't affect the females at all. This wing bow is kind of broken up on the Female line birds, <clears throat> you want a little bit of this black in him right there. And even a little bit in their hackle, it don't bother the female line. Your wing bow should be broken up like this. I mean, this is fairly good female line breeder. Like I said, he could be a little cobbier. He's a little long in the body. But this is a good breeder pair to start with. They're just things to look for whenever you're trying to pick out a show bird in female life. That main thing is this shafting right here. Now you may have, you can see that shafted. I don't see any vermentation in her. And that's what that is, is this stippling on the feather. 
this gray, mm -hmm. it'll look like when they have what they call vermentation, it'll look like there's worms kind of went through there. That's the best description. But she's pretty, like I said, she's pretty smooth. Pretty good pair to start with. You just have to cull hard whenever, whenever they mature out. Silver duck wings, it takes a long time for them to mature out. That's, that's one of the bad things about, well, not just silver duck wings, but BB, your duck wings. You have to really wait till they get their last feathers in. They'll, as chicks, they'll moat six, seven times. And if you get rid of them for their final moat, they get their adult feathers in, you may be getting rid of something that was good. So you have to kind of hold on to them for a while. Where can people find you? Uh, in Alabama at my house. <laughs> I, I don't really have an e email or anything like that. I, I'm just old school. My Facebook had a chicken show. That's about it. Thank you for letting me interview you. Oh, you're welcome. If I can help you, you let me know. I probably got some birds at the house I can probably help you with as far as female. And good luck. You've done well so far. Thank you. Good luck to you too. Oh, thank you. You can also find him at the Heart of Dixie Poultry Show. He is a hard worker. He helps set up the uh, show, put cages up, even cleans up after the show. So if you're close to Fort Payne, you might want to stop by and see him. Hard of Dixie, best show in the southeast. <laughs>